great day in Soviet Union today, bread lines were short, work days were long, great leader Vladimir Lenin is still sleeping soundly, great leader uh, Stalin is keeping Lenin's chair warm for him on his imminent return. Uh, oh, boy, boy, breaking news, comrades. Cuban reporter Juan Hronsky is live from Moscow at the Kremlin. Bosha boy! Come in, Comrade Hronsky. Thank you, Rick. We are here outside the Kremlin in this chilly December 1948 day. And inside, we have Conrad Stalin reading about a recently published letter addressed to him by a Soviet engineer called Kendrick Altschul. In that letter, he claims that there is chaos and ignorance in the Soviet Union's approach to innovation. However, he disclosed that in his study of Russian patents, he's discovered important patterns in the way engineering systems evolve and develop. This revelation can, in fact, revolutionize the way engineers and product designers innovate. Altschuler wanted to answer why some products survived while others failed. To help explain these trends of evolution, we'll use the automobile as an example, but the rules are statistically true for all categories of engineering systems, and therefore can be applied universally to any field. The first trend of evolution is that all engineering systems get developed in the pursuit of increasing value. That is, they naturally evolve by delivering greater functionality with less cost. As engineering systems are developed, the growth of the main parameters of value move towards higher value following an S-shaped curve over time. What is commonly known in the marketing field as the life cycle of birth, growth, maturity, and death of products can be described in technical evolution of engineering systems as the stages of improving functionality, improving performance, improving reliability, improving convenience, and improving costs. Jumping to a new S-curve means that there is a new way to provide the desired function and replace outmoded technology. In our next installment, we'll cover other statistically proven trends of evolution. Reported for the TRIS short course series, I am Juan Aranda. Thank you.